Okay, what's up guys? So, for the new subscribers out there, because I haven't done a video like this in a while, but uh, yeah, from time to time I do uh, motivational videos, excuse me, I do like little TED Talks, um, what other names you can call it, I don't know, but other than that, yeah, from time to time I do motivational videos, just to get people inspired, get them uh, motivated, driven to do whatever they want to do in life, whether they want to be a sports athlete, a news anchor, a YouTuber, do you want to be a doctor? I don't like you want to be an animal at the state fair. Do that, all right? Do whatever makes you happy overall. But don't overall like I don't want you to change for anybody out there. And uh, there was like the other the, the other day I was talking with a fan and uh, they were telling me that they wanted to be somebody different. Now I don't know overall if they're doing that for themselves or if they're doing that for others, but overall like tell I, I what did i tell that person because i overall want them to just be themselves all right and if them if being themselves is like being different in things then okay cool like all respect to that but if you're changing who you want to be because other people don't respect it or they don't like it no start all the way from the beginning and the one message that you need to tell yourself is that you will not change who you are because other people don't like you the way you are. That's one thing that should never ever change about you. You shall always live your whole life being who you like who you overall want to be. So like if you want to like I don't know, like in their situation they were I don't know. I feel like cuz I I'm not trying to put them on blast. I ain't going to say any names. And I overall don't want anybody trying to find out who this person is, but they wanted to they were a girl wanting to be a boy and i'm like that's you know what do what you want to do but if that was driven from somebody and that wasn't like your own like that or your own thing that you wanted to do and things because i i see that and that's something i always say to like ask myself like are they doing that because they think people are not going to like them the way that they are because if that's the case like talking about that separately you should yeah you should never ever change who you are because other people are not going to like that. See, here's the thing. I was thinking about this yesterday. There might be a small group of people that don't like you, all right? And this can be school related, this can be internet related, this can be related to anything, but there's going to be a small amount of people that don't like you. Billions of people are covering this planet we call Earth. There's going, okay? And this is a fact. There's going to be a million people that love you always there's somebody right now in this world like painting you as an image and they're overall trying to just find out like why do you think that they got like websites like dating websites out there where they're you're they're wanting you to find your match and then you match with like a million people across the earth and things like overall, if it wasn't just something where it's like you're matching with somebody like in your local city or your local area and stuff, like you match with everybody in the world, yeah, millions of people that like the same things that you like, that eat the same foods that you eat, they over there overall, they like you, they love you, they're wanting to find a person like you. So that's why I'm like, to people out there that change their appearances or change who they are because there is a small group of people that don't like it. There's that small group. There's billions of people on Earth. Not the whole planet, okay? Everybody on Earth, they don't like you. It's just that small group. So that's why I'm like, yeah, that's, I, I see stuff like that and I always wonder if it's like, and if it's something where it's like, you want to change, you want to be different, then okay. I have, I have nothing but respect for that. But if it's something where it's like, and I, I don't know, like, maybe that could be the case, but if it's a case where people are like, oh, I'm doing this because others don't accept me, don't worry about what people accept like that's i'm like that's that's one thing that it's like i just discovered and figure out in life is that everybody is not going to accept you everybody is like not going to like you everybody is like and i'm cool with that i'm okay with that if people don't like me if people don't accept me then that's on them they just gonna have to i'm overall i want them to find somebody that they can um accept and they can like but if they're expecting me to change that's not going to happen who I am is who I am. That's never going to change. So that's why I'm like, yeah, I, that's that's why I just like, I live my life to where it's just like, I 
I overall like really don't care what people have to think about me and things. But um, yeah, overall, if I want to change, like that's that's my choice. All right, I'm in control of my life, nobody else. So that's there's that things. But talking about something else separately, um, like I don't know, like I don't know what else I can really like add into this whole be humble um, positivity rant. But uh, yeah, overall, like I I just want people to just be themselves with whatever you want to do in life, you know, and just work as hard as you possibly can. If you need to stay up every night and just fall asleep at random times, do do whatever you possibly can to just achieve everything that you want to achieve in life and always be humble. Always be humble. Don't ever think for one second that people are not going to accept you or you're not you're not good enough or you're not going to make it everybody has the thing is is because there's throughout okay for an example bill gates throughout his journey you think everybody accepted that man you think everybody believed in that man there's probably somebody on the sidelines watching him like that man's never going to make it he wants to own a company called microsoft what is a microsoft somebody explain that to me what 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 is a microsoft and look at him billionaire status he has his company microsoft that man he did like that's come on like that's i i feel like when you see when you see people like him and he's like that man he's like got a big fancy house nice car that man got memes being made about him of him jumping on over chairs and stuff like yeah that man made it and he don't have to overall worry about anything that anybody has to say about him. I'm pretty sure those people that was doubting him, saying, like, you know, oh, he ain't going to make it, like, he's never going to make it and things, they're probably looking at him now like, wow, he made it. And look at me, so busy, worried about him, I didn't have time to worry about myself, and now here I am, not a billionaire, okay? Don't have my own company. Don't have electronics that's every that's being sold in stores and everybody is buying it every single day. No, they're working. They're working for his company. So overall, I want people to be that person where you own a company and the people that doubt at you, they're working for your company. They had no other choice. I feel like, yeah, like situations like the CEO of Amazon or the owner, whoever he is. But um, yeah, that guy, for an example, everybody is like working for Amazon at some point in time in their life. Like, I feel like it's going to probably, there's, I, I don't know. I, I probably, there, there might, well, I mean, I got the job that I got now. It's cool. I like it. But I think if I wasn't working at this job, yeah, I probably would have worked at Amazon. But guaranteed, guaranteed that like throughout everybody that has doubted that man, all right, that works for, uh, Am- or like, you know, he's the CEO of Amazon and stuff. I'm pretty sure somebody that doubted him, they most likely worked for his company they did positive that they did all right and it's like that's into honestly to well it's like because i feel like like yeah in that situation he ain't going to be worried about that he ain't worried about anybody that's doubting him all right that man is still going to come out with ideas still come out with stuff that's going to overall just help help his business help himself and help the world and that's what you got to do in life you got to help your business help yourself and help the world out do whatever you possibly can, like, to give back to yourself for not giving up and then to give back to others for not doubting you. So, yeah, overall, like, yeah, don't don't ever uh, doubt. Don't ever doubt yourself because it's like you doubt yourself. Then, yeah, overall, like it's or it's just like you're not giving enough time for yourself. And I've had to say I've fallen in a case where I um, I didn't really doubt myself, but I overall didn't give enough time to myself. Now I felt like that I wasted time. And it's like looking back and thinking on the like all the time that I had to achieve everything that I wanted to achieve. There's videos that I made today that I could have made two, three years ago when I had the time to, you know, do YouTube full time and things. But it's like now it's like now I got work for another company, but I guess it's good working at this other company because now I've given myself the tools to really like widen out my variety of video ideas and stuff. So overall, like, yeah, I just I feel like that that's probably the problem in this world. People don't give themselves enough time. And that's like something I always see like being shared around on social media, like always like focus on your health and focus on yourself. But it's like, and it's, you know, that people just get caught up and then they don't do it. And now they're in a situation where they can't really focus on themselves. But 
it's cool. Like it's uh, you you got like the thing is you got multiple chances in life. Excuse me. So don't don't ever yeah don't ever think that it's too late or it's too early or you know there's not enough time. Like no, you have all the time in the world to achieve whatever you want to achieve. So if you want to go to the music studio and record a song, do that. If you want to try out to be an athlete, do that. If you want to see how um, you would be on the YouTube or any platform, do that. Do whatever it takes to just put yourself in a situation where you think that life is perfect. And then once you get to that point, then keep putting more work in. All right. Once you get to that perfect lifestyle, then we're like this ain't per- more like I need this to be more perfect. I need this to just keep going and going and going. Until it gets to a point in time where it's like, okay, like, this is cool. Like, where you can settle down, you're all like, I'm happy with where I'm at. So, anyways, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. It's It's been a while since I recorded the videos. I, I, I don't know, like, I ain't really, I mean, I recorded gaming videos and stuff. But, um, yeah, overall, I was just all like, yeah, just... I was sitting there recording NBA. That's what I was doing. That's what was op- occupying my time. NBA 2K20. I was sitting there recording videos on that and was losing my mind. Okay, that game. That game stressed me out to the point to where I was like, I had to um go and get me another game. I was like, I, I don't want to play this game anymore. So, anyways, you guys are gonna probably see me playing a lot of this game, Monster Hunter World, Iceborne. But uh, I have to get through like the main part, of Monster Monster Hunter World. So yeah. Stay tuned for some videos on that on my gaming channel. Then also I'm trying to like slowly get back into the uh, hang of things on my other channels. And yeah, just be the uh, YouTuber that never sleeps. So uh, I think that should be my nickname, the YouTuber that never sleeps. Because I'm constantly thinking of uh, ideas and stuff with YouTube. Like there's there's nights where I'm like, dang man, <laughs> like I should be in bed. But anyways... I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully this video was motivating and it got you through whatever funk you're dealing with. But yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Like, subscribe if you're new to the channel and peace.